Sure. The helpful folks at Harris Ace Hardware say thank you for choosing Harris Ace as your favorite place to buy hardware and building supplies. Stop by Harris Ace Hardware and check out their weekly deals. Sign up for Ace Rewards and start earning points toward coupons and rewards. You'll even receive a $5 coupon just for signing up. Harris Ace Hardware in Jessup, Hinesville, Yolonia, and now in Brunswick. They are ready to serve your everyday building and hardware needs. Harris Ace Hardware. It's time now for local ASN local sports and sports. The Wayne County Yellow Jackets head to Richmond Hill Friday night, taking on the Wildcats. Our coverage will begin at six thirty with the Wayne County Coaches Show. Here's a portion of the show where Coach Ken Cribb talks about how good this Wildcat football team is. They're, they're, they have numbers of seven A. Uh, they they got approved to play down in six A, and they do have a wealth of, uh, of athletes and talent. Uh, very very well coached, and uh, they, they do an incredible job. And I was at the game when they lost out last year, and I'll tell you, the other team made two back to back. Uh, unbelievable plays with time. I mean, that game was over. Richmond Hill was moved, going on to the state championship, and a uh, uh, team just made two unbelievable plays back to back to steal it. And uh, other than that, you know, Richmond Hill may be defending state champion. To be honest with you. So uh, they got a lot of kids back. And they they they're hungry from that from that season. You know, for coming up short, and uh, you know they're going to be tough to tough to handle for anybody. Again, we had a week of practice, but the weather's been kind of crazy this week. So have you been able to get outside and have good practices this week, or has the weather caused a little havoc? We've gotten some in. <clears throat> it's been tough. It's, last week was horrible. This week's been pretty bad, too. Uh, I'm ready for this weather to break so we can just have some cool weather and, and be dry and no lightning so uh, so we can really work. But uh, it's, it's another another obstacle to overcome, and, uh, you know, it, it, it wears on you. Kids get tired of watching so much film, and uh, – Anytime you go inside, it's just you just don't have any room. We need to love to have an indoor facility like a lot of high school programs have now. You know, build a big old one twenty by one twenty steel building, with some big fans in it, and have a chance to go somewhere and really do something during during this type of weather. And being in South Georgia, we're gonna we're gonna have this weather. I mean, it's, it's every year, so uh, um, it, it makes it tough. It makes it tough when you don't get to be outside and get, get all your work in that you need to do. And that's a portion of the coach show. You can hear all the coaches come in at 6.30 tomorrow night. No pre-sale tickets available. All tickets purchased online at GoFan.com. Jackets will have a young sophomore quarterback in the game Friday night as junior quarterback Trey Pierce lost for the season with an injury he suffered in the loss to Pierce County. Tommy Weather's been guest to start Friday, and Coach Cribb talks about that change in, on the coaches show as well. Again, you can hear the coaches show at 6.30 tomorrow, followed by the pregame show at 7 from the stadium. After the game, stay tuned for the Country Financial Post Game Show. Again, that's this Friday night. Wayne County against Richmond Hill. We'll talk with Richmond Hill coach Matt Lazar tomorrow on the World Famous Pitch and Bob Show. He'll tell us what we can expect from the Wildcast tomorrow when we head over there tomorrow night. Again, also this year, every Friday night at halftime, a new feature as we look back at great moments and great athletes in Wayne County football history. This Friday night, look back at the career of Lindsey Scott, who coached John Donaldson. In the 70s, recruited out of the high school band as Lindsey played the trumpet, but once he hit the football field, the rest was history. Fantastic high school career, signed with the Dogs, and still is part of the Georgia's greatest play ever. His 93-yard catch in the 1980 Georgia-Florida game, November 8th. Larry Munson's best call ever, run Lindsey run. Lindsey then an important pick by the Saints. Can take a look back at his career this Friday night during the halftime show. Varsity girls softball team was originally scheduled to play at Warner Robins this afternoon, but that game's been moved to Saturday. First pitch Saturday at 10.30 a.m., Cross country teams over in Hazelhurst today. That race gets underway at 4:30. Has the results for you on Friday sportscast. JV game today against Camden at 5 p.m. That's also been canceled, so no JV football game today. Martha Puckett football today at Direct Field at 4:30. They host Bacon County Middle School softball today. Arthur Williams plays Long County today at the high school field. Braves lose to the Orioles Wednesday. Final score five to one. Braves have the day off. They'll be in action Friday through Sunday in New York to take on the Mets. Speaking of New York, that's the site of this week's U.S. Open, which gets underway shortly. Of course, wing foot, one of the toughest courses around the first round today, final round Sunday. question is, can anyone shoot under par at the course? What will be the winning number? Golf Channel has the coverage in the morning from 7.30 to 2. Then NBC has it from 2 to 5 in the afternoon. Headline reads, wing foot stands undefeated. Most golfers were asked, when asked who's going to win this weekend, the answer, wing foot, it always does. Once again, the U.S. Open today through Sunday. And in college football, the Big Ten yesterday voted to begin play in October to be eligible to play, be in the playoffs in the national title game. The pressure just continued to mount. Everyone else is playing, so the Big Ten, again, who made a decision early to cancel their season, 
reverse that decision yesterday. They'll play an eight-game schedule and again be eligible for the four-team playoff in the national championship. That's going to do it for the latest in local sports. Sports is brought to you each and every day this time by friends at Harris Ace Hardware. BoomerNaturals.com presents the Sports Flash on Big Dog Country 105.5.